Hello? How's it going, Joe? Huh? Asia Travel Company? Okay, just a moment. Huh? Hello? It's Jimmy from Asia Travel. I've got your ticket. I'd like for you to come and pick it up. Please come to the U Arcade on Dubuita at noon. Yosa, what was that phone call about? The ticket to Hong Kong. Oh, I see. I'm going out. Oh, okay. So, welcome back everybody. This is Boom Shakalaka. Back again with our first time playthrough of Shenmue for the PlayStation 4. Jimmy called me to URK at noon. So I've got a bad feeling about this. I, I don't think I'm going to peacefully get my ticket that I rightfully paid for. Just coming back in here to grab my money. Hey, give me that money. There we go. Today's allowance. Who couldn't use an extra 500? So I'm gonna, I got until noon to kill. So I'm gonna go through the other districts here. Just to see if there are any other uh, side missions to complete before we before we leave. Surprised I can't pet the kitty. Yeah, because I I've explored these areas a little bit, but I don't know. It was right when I first started the game that I came down here and since then I've got a better grasp of how the game operates, so it doesn't look like there's anything worthwhile though. So back up we go. Go down here a little bit. Yeah, as much as I'm appreciating and enjoying the game. I just do not see modern gamers liking it. Perhaps they're out? It takes an old school gamer like myself to uh, appreciate some of these older games. I don't think anybody's in. Oh. Yeah, let's see if anybody's here then. No one's home. And while certainly there's certainly a fair share of older classic games that stand up and are just as good, kind of timeless. I wouldn't say Shenmue is exactly timeless. It's a classic for what it did at the time, but not a timeless classic. Hey. There, there. Nice cat I can Good pet. kitty. Just a little guy. How are you doing? <laughs> I bet you remember me, don't you? Yeah, you better. For giving you tofu instead of, uh, fish. Well, I haven't seen that before, I don't think. 
Or at least I've never zoomed in and looked inside. Now let's go to uh, this other district here before we head to Dubuita and head, hit up the U Arcade. Another relic of the past, a phone booth. Ah, which I don't really use. But let's spend money on it anyways. Just give a little do donation. Noriko. What's up? What are you up to? Huh? Oh, just thinking. Wondering why Eddie is so upset. Eddie? Yeah, but she won't say why. I think it's about Nozomi. Dio, do you know anything about it? Me? No, I don't. I see. Noriko. Oh, Dio, why do you think Eddie is so upset? I wonder. I see. Well, got to go now. Right. Bye for now. I don't know who Eerie is, and I don't know... I, yeah. I don't know how I would know why she'd be upset, but anyways. Tatsuya. Do. Why so down? I think a good one is ready to come out of this capsule toy machine. Do. please give me a hundred yen. You're always saying that. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. Ah oh, man! I was actually gonna give him the money. Hi. Hey, mister! Let's play baseball! Sorry, maybe later, okay? I was actually gonna play baseball with him. This game... It wants you to kill time, but then it doesn't give you anything to, to do in that time. Except talk to people. Kondo-san. Oh, hello, Nyo. You always seem well. Give my regards to Ine-san. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Another relic of the past. Excuse me. Oh, Ryo. Is this a good time? What's on your mind? I want to show you something. What is it? Uh, this. What an unusual stone mirror. Apparently, it is called the Phoenix Mirror. I see. There is a phoenix carved into it. Is there anything special about this mirror? Hmm. Well, the phoenix is a sacred bird of legend. But, uh, this has an ominous feel. Ominous? In China, there are many treasures that contain both good and bad fortune. This is called the secret of yin and yang. The secret of yin and yang? You'd best be careful. This may have something to do with your father's unfortunate death. I don't know if this information helps, but that's all I can tell you. I see. Thank you very much. Oh, you had some good info there. Not necessarily good, but interesting. When the dragon ascends and the phoenix descends, something occurs. Which, uh, I believe it was Master Chen informed us that uh, a monster of some sort rises from the ground. Landy still does not know there are two mirrors. Maybe I can practice here. Think I'll warm up a bit. You know what? Let's uh, it's getting close to noon. Let's let's make our way to to Buita 
and uh, I have a feeling we're gonna get jumped by how many guys I don't know we'll have to find out uh, can I pet the dog nope so yeah I, I feel like uh, I feel like a fight is coming. There's Santa again. And we'll make our way down there and see what they have in store for us. 